Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So, if you are seeing constant pop-ups from Adobe Genuine Software Integrity Service on your Windows 11 laptop or PC, just like this one, and you are tired of it interrupting with your workflow, this video is certainly for you. Maybe it shows up every time you start your computer or maybe it randomly pops up while you are working in your Photoshop, Illustrator or even if you are using your Adobe apps at all. I know it's quite frustrating and a lot of users are confused about what it is and why it shows up and how to get rid of it safely. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through multiple working methods to actually fix this problem. We will go over what Adobe Genuine Software Service actually is, how to disable it from starting automatically, how to remove it safely from your system if you are no longer using Adobe, and how to do all of this without damaging your system or detecting any uh, something critical so before proceeding into this video make sure you check out the useful links in the description of all the sources mentioned in this video now without further delay let's get straight into it so first of all we need to understand what is adobe genuine software integrity service so as i said earlier this is the alert this type of alert that you are going to get so this alert usually pops up when you have a cracked or unlicensed version of any of the Adobe software or even if you have a legitimate copy but Adobe's system misleads your license. Sometimes the service continues running even after you uninstall your Adobe software and its purpose is to actually detect the counterfeit software and notify you if your version is Adobe uh, if it is genuine or not. But it can also show up unnecessarily especially after the updates or if you have uninstalled adobe application improperly so here is how you can deal with this particular error first of all we will start by disabling the genuine services from services.msc in order to do it you just have to simply press windows plus r on your keyboard and then you will see this type of pop-up in front of you now over here in this pop-up you will have to enter this command that is services.msc then you need to simply press ok now over here in the services window you need to simply scroll down and here you need to try to find adobe genuine software integrity services so here it will be on the top or maybe in the bottom so you just have to try to find adobe genuine software integrity services and then you just have to right click on that and then you need to go to properties now in the properties pop-up you just have to simply set the startup to disable and uh, if the services is running you just have to click on the stop button and apply to this change and then you need to press ok so what this will going to do is this is going to stop the alert from running at startup and you won't see the pop-up unless the service is triggered manually now if after doing this step or this method your issue is still there you can try this method in which you just have to uh, simply um, delete the adobe gci folder from your program files so this method work if you are no longer using adobe software and if you want to completely remove the detection tool for that you need to open your file explorer just like so and then you need to open your c drive here you will see the folder of program files so click on that now among the given folders select the common files folder and then select adobe now in adobe you will see adobe gc client so here you will see that folder and you need to right click on that folder and you need to simply delete that so you may need the admin permission if windows says the file is in use you can try restarting your PC and deleting it immediately after logging in. So this folder contains the Adobe Genuine uh, Checker files. Uh, so removing them will actually stop the alerts permanently. Now here is one important thing that you need to remember. 
you need to only do this step if you are sure that you don't need adobe's protection system for licensing the verification now if uh, these two methods aren't working for you you can also try this um, third method in which you can use task scheduler to actually block the alerts for that you need to press windows plus s on your keyboard and then you just have to simply search for task scheduler now this is task scheduler so you need to simply click on it now once you do this you will see this type of pop-up in front of you where you need to go to the task scheduler library and uh, over here you need to simply search for adobe now here you need to look for anything that is labeled as adobe gc invoker or any genuine software task uh, if you are able to find that you just have to simply uh, right click on that and uh, you need to simply disable that or delete if you are not using adobe at all so this is going to prevent the system from auto starting adobe's checker scripts every time you log in so if these three methods aren't working for you you can also try this fourth method in which you need to delete the adobe gc related registry entries and uh, in order to do it first of all you will have to simply close all of your windows and press windows plus r on your keyboard again now once you see this type of pop-up again you will have to type this command that is reg edit here you need to press ok and now it will ask for the permissions so you will have to simply apply ok then you need to navigate to your computer h key underscore local machine software adobe and you need to look for any folder or any key with the name of adobe gc client if you are able to find that you need to simply right click and then delete that then you need to go to other path and i will also put the link of that path down in the description you need to delete the ag services or adobe uh, g invokers if they exist now always create a backup of your registry before making any changes and this is an advanced step for the users who want a deep clean so only do it if you are aware of it and do not um, you know use this setting if you are not aware of it now uh, you can use the auto runs by microsoft to detect any hidden startup items as well so there would be some adobe backgrounds that uh, uh, that are provide the tasks that may still run even after installing them so you can download any auto runs uh, from microsoft's website so you can just either click on the microsoft store and uh, over here you can just type auto run and after typing it you can just simply download any of these this is auto run organizer so you can get this application in your device then you need to simply run it as an administrator and use the search bar and type adobe gc then you need to unlock any entries that is relating to adobe gc or adobe genuine software and this tool actually digs deeper into the task manager and it will let you spot anything that's still still scheduled to run at startup and that's how you can basically fix the adobe genuine software integrity services alert on windows 11 so whether you are still using adobe applications or not these steps will help you to take control of those annoying pop-ups so if this video helped you out give it a like share it with your friends and subscribe for more easy to follow windows fixes if you have any questions you can drop them in the comments i'm, I'm here to help you out with that thanks for watching this video i will see you in the next one